get down to business. What's the first case that we're going to look at this morning? The clerk at the Super C on West A Street reported a woman came into the store upset and tried to take it out on the clerk. Um, when the clerk asked her to leave, the woman knocked a bunch of items onto the floor, including the entire phone charger display. Um, we do have some information we'd like to share that could give somebody the information they need to help identify her. We were told the male she was with maybe went by the name JT. She had a small child with her, a tattoo on her chest, and she was in a black Chevy Camaro. So some pretty mm -hmm. specific details there. If anybody knows anything about this case or who she is, we'd um, encourage them to leave a tip. Yeah, and, and hopefully get that woman some help, the help that she needs. Uh, what's the second case that we're going to look at? On Tuesday, April 18th, around 8 p.m., the victim in this case was walking around his neighborhood a block south of 27th and O Street. He walked by a house here where he was approached by a group of people, where he approached a group of people and attempted to talk to them. He said one of the guys in the group cursed at him, so he took this as his cue to walk away. But while he was walking away, the guy who cursed at him followed him displayed a knife, gently Ooh. ran it down the victim's arm while they were in the middle of the street. And then um, the victim thought maybe after this he would leave him alone, but he didn't. He followed him across the street where he punched him in the face um, so hard the victim was knocked to the ground. Yeah. So um, we really need some help identifying this suspect. Uh, he has at least a couple of tattoos on his right arm, one on his upper right arm and another um, larger tattoo on his forearm, possibly like a sleeve tattoo mm -hmm. that were visible in the video. So if anybody knows um, who the suspect is, we'd love some help on this case. Okay, so if you know anything about either one of the cases that you just heard about, you can send your tips to Crime Stoppers. You can submit an anonymous tip through the P3 app. It's available for both Apple and Android devices. You can also call Crime Stoppers at 475-3600 or leave a tip online at linkingcrimestoppers.com.